you are being controlled right now. In this moment, your decisions are not being made by you. And that's a bold statement to make, but it is absolutely true. I will tell you exactly how it's happening, but you need to listen very carefully. It's called the illusion of control. And it is exactly why I have chosen not to watch TV in over 10 years. We believe that we are in control of the media that we consume because we have the power to change the channel. But no matter what channel you are on, the programs that you are watching are programming you. Programming your values, programming your beliefs, programming your ideas, and the scariest part of all, they are programming the decisions you then make without you even realizing it. Here are two things that you need to know about the mainstream media. One, the news is a multi-billion dollar industry. Two, the media companies choose a handful of stories to cover each and every single day. That means that there's a 24 hour slot that needs to be filled with content. And guess what? The narrative is controlled in order to create a reaction in you. A reaction of fear, a reaction of doubt, a reaction of uncertainty. The reason for this is simple. Your brain is wired to react to danger and fear. It's a basic survival instinct. The media companies know this and they are intentionally tricking you, controlling you and manipulating you. In the media's eyes, your fear equals money. There are so many great things happening in the world right now that we do not hear about through the mainstream media. We don't hear about people's wins. We don't hear about their breakthroughs. We don't hear about the really powerful, positive, good changes which are happening. We're living in such an abundant time, yet most people don't realize that because of the programming that they're led to believe. Humans have an innate instinct to keep each other informed. This is not going to change anytime soon. Our obsession for searching for the truth has helped us in the long run. But good intentions can always be exploited through organizations and corporations who understand human psychology and have their own agendas at play. That's why we need to make a promise to each other to now put a question mark at the end of every news headline. I need you to remind yourself every single day that you are not willing to be controlled or manipulated. Your thoughts matter. Your freedom matters. Your control over your own life matters. I need you to take back your power. This is Regan Hillier and thank you so much for watching. Over 7 billion people are being controlled and manipulated right now. I invite you not to be one of those people. I care about you and I deeply care about your freedom. Please take a stand, share this video, and let yourself and the whole world know that you are not willing to be controlled, programmed, or manipulated, and you're not willing to let your loved ones be controlled either. I love you so much. Thank you for watching.